With the resumption of the new legal year, the premises of the Federal High Court has been activated with a big level of activities. To produce on the West. Running into judiciary correspondence on Wednesday, Ozokame was highly opinionated on issues bordering on the evolution of powers, restructuring, and the current militarization of the Southeast. Before an organization can be termed a terrorist organization, there has to be a complaint by the Attorney General of the Federation, or the Inspector General of Police, or the Director General of the Department of State Security, DSS. The complaint must be filed before a judge in chambers. And before they even filed, filed this complaint, they have to seek the consent of Mr. President. Then the judge in chambers will hear the complaint. Whether IPO is actually a terrorist organization. It is actually the pronouncement of a court of law that will now be gazetted in the official gazette of the federal government that can pro proscribe anybody okay. or any organization as a terrorist organization. When you look at the fundamentally faulted foundation of Nigeria as established by Lord Lugard on the 1st of January 1914, you would require that there are certain issues that continue to trouble us as a people, as certain fault lines, fault lines that we must look at. Even the name Nigeria itself was not given to us by us. It was given to us by young British journalist, Flora Shaw, Flora Louisa Shaw, who wrote an article in the London Financial Times of 1897 that that area around the Niger, Niger area, that's how we got our name. And ever since then, we have been having problems of self-identity. And before we were amalgamated on the 1st of January 1940 by Loluga, we were already re living together as big nations, big empires, or your empire, remember? Leading to the punitive expedition of 1897. Remember the role of people like Nana of Ishekure, people like Jaja of Opobo, the Oyo Messi, the Allah of Oyo. We already had the, the, you remember people like Queen Amina, Madame Tinibu, Queen Idia, Otman Danfodio. We already have our separate empires and we were already administering our governments before we were cobbled together, the southern and northern protectorates. While stakeholders continue to lend their views on national discourse, it is hoped that the government of the day will deliberate on the views and pick that which is more valuable and pertinent to the growth of the nation. Emmanuel Bagudu, PTV News.